मैं हम्बल प्रणाम स्टू ब्रह्मश्री पिता महापत्रे जी एंड माय सोल फैमिली हेलो फ्रेंड्स नमस्ते माय नेम इज बिंदु फ्रॉम लंदन यूके अ बिट ऑफ एन इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट माय सेल्फ आई एम अ चार्टर्ड अकाउंटेंट बाय प्रोफेशन आई वर्क इन आईटी फॉर वन ऑफ द लार्जेस्ट रिटेलर इन द यूके आई एम हैप्पीली मैरिड लिविंग विद माय हस्बैंड एंड टू यंग बॉयज 17 एंड 12 इयर्स ओल्ड I want to give you a bit of intro about my journey into meditation. I started uh, my journey into meditation a year ago. I got introduced to Anapana Sati meditation through Ranjit Karu from the Light Workers Group in India. I started meditating for 30 minutes each day and later started increasing it for an hour. Initially I had challenges because of lots of thoughts coming in my mind but later it got better and better I started following PMC channel on YouTube and started listening to all those wonderful experiences shared by the pyramid masters I was very much fascinated and amazed listening to these experiences which every experience was so unique I was totally inspired and motivated to know more about meditation and really want to understand how a simple technique of watching your breath or observing your breath can do wonders to your life. So this is how I started I st- in this journey I started attending many workshops conducted by PSSM. I've attended Seth workshop I've attended Purnatma workshop, I've attended um, DNA workshop and most importantly the Inner Journey program that was conducted by Seth Balakrishna Garu from India. With these uh, workshops has truly given me amazing experiences during my meditation. This has actually helped me in involvement in my spiritual journey. I've started reading simultaneously started reading many books which has given me so much of knowledge to understand these spiritual concepts much better. I would like to explain a bit about my life before and after meditation. Before meditation I used to suffer from very bad migraine headaches. Once the migraine headache kicks in I used to suffer continuously for 3 days. I used to take tablets uh, in order to subside the pain, but the pain wouldn't go away for 3 days in a row and my family used to really struggle because of me suffering from migraine headaches. So after I started meditating I have noticed that 90% of my migraine headaches have now gone away. I don't really seem to get headaches at all now. The migraine headaches were you mainly caused because of the hormones of stress and work pressure. And also I would like to explain one great eye opener for me when I came into meditation was understanding of uh, the concept of about no interference no judgments and no comments this is something that has deeply touched my heart because as a family we seem to have lot of differences in understanding and lot of differences in opinions so i used to get so upset with my children when they weren't listening but then once i have understood that children do come through us but we have no right to um, you know inhibit their growth for our personal uh, needs so this is where i've learned that i would only guide them but then i would not interfere very much into their um, and i would let them do what they really want to do so this is this is a huge transformation because once i have changed my attitude towards my children and my family i've seen life is so beautiful 
because everyone seemed to understand and everyone has been given the space and I've learned that there's only one relation in a family which is friendship this is truly something I believe and this is truly something I love to practice and this is something which has really created a, a great positive impact in our lives I have seen a great shift in my mindset and my thinking I have moved away from fear-based emotions to love-based emotions I started living in the present moment not worrying about what actually happened in the past not worrying about something uh, that is going to happen in the future so this this is something so magical and so beautiful because I am in the present moment and enjoying the present moment and regardless of what situation it is or what circumstances it might be, I have understood every, every circumstance that come into our life has come to us to teach a lesson and this is what I have understood after coming into meditation. So this is I started loving myself much more. I started spending more time with myself. I started politely saying no to the people which doesn't fit in with, with my attitude purely because I wanted to be in the same vibration um, doing meditation and doing or reading books so this is what I wanted to do so I have inculcated reading habits much more which I have never done before but coming into meditation I started reading more and more books attending lots and lots of workshops the most important thing I have learned is we create our own reality we are the creator of our life through our feelings, through our emotions and through our thoughts. Meditation and mindfulness has helped me to empower myself. I would like to give you a few examples how meditation has helped me in my workplace. At my workplace, I do have some uh, people who are very challenging and who are very demanding. Whenever I had a meeting with them, I was always nervous I was scared so so I used to get migraine headaches much more but then I started working on myself I tried to understand what is it that is causing me to kind of have that fear-based emotion so this is when I when I sat into meditation every day I started sending out the love energies to the people and visualized as if everything is so normal we are very good friends and guess what this is the reality everything turned out to be magical everything was so amazing that we we kind of became friends and there was no more of that um, uh, fear-based emotions cropping up and it was just so beautiful rapport that has developed between the business and myself so I realized the outer world is actually a reflection of our inner world whenever we are scared or whenever we are we have a negative feeling about something there is not something wrong about the other person or the other circumstance everything is within us it is us who's actually creating the reality so I've started working more and more on myself, trying to cleanse myself through meditation and having that positive mindset always and also loving everyone, accepting everyone literally as they are because every person comes with a soul design and this is what something I have actually learned through meditation. So things got better and better even at my home and even at my workplace. I have read many books coming into, into PSSM. I read the books like The Secret, You Forever, You're the Placebo, Biology of Beliefs, um, The Power of Subconscious Mind and many more. Reading all these books has helped me to rewire my brain. 
Meditation helped me to understand the power of mind and how can we reprogram in our subconscious mind um, in order for us to do much more. We have infinite potential within ourselves. But surely because of the limiting beliefs that we have, there is something that is stopping us to do what we should be doing. So this is where meditation has helped me to come off my limiting beliefs and try to understand how can I overcome it and achieve my own full potential. I've started learning many, many um, spiritual, um, gaining spiritual knowledge from many career med masters across the globe. And I'm very grateful to all the pyramid masters who has been um, very helpful in sharing their wisdom. Without the help of the pyramid masters, I, I don't know where I would have been. But surely with the help of pyramid masters, my deepest gratitude to each and everyone who's helped me in my spiritual journey. I started volunteering um, teaching meditation the whatever joy i faced or i experienced in my life when i came into meditation and this is what i like to spread it to the whole world this is when i have decided that i wanted to start teaching meditation um, the most easiest place i would teach meditation is my is at my workplace hence i started teaching mindfulness and meditation calling it the breath mindful meditation so i spoke about the importance of mindfulness and meditation and how mindfulness would help corporate employees in order to achieve their full potential and also achieve their goals and mostly um, this, most diseases in this world are caused because of stress which are psychosomatic diseases so hence why i created that awareness at my workplace and started teaching meditation as well as the spiritual concepts like gratitude um, and many other concepts so this is something that was very well received by my company and they're extremely grateful for bringing up this initiative in my company after coming into meditation now it's been over a year now i really understood the true purpose of my life there is a purpose everyone comes into this world and this is where i have discovered that i have a purpose to be fulfilled I had a deep intuition while in my inner journey program, which I was doing with Seth Balakrishna Garu, that I should be doing something much more than what I'm doing in my profession currently. My life purpose is to spread meditation and spiritual sciences to this world. The whole intention is to add value to other people's life, help them unlock their full potential and make them the architects of their own life. So this is where I have, I have deeply, deeply got connected to my life purpose and I'm really striving and trying to achieve it. Friends, I would really like to urge and to, for everyone to practice meditation and spread meditation, making this earth a beautiful place to live. I'm extremely grateful to everyone who has helped me in my spiritual journey um, to overcome, overcome my limiting beliefs and life has turned out to be truly magical after coming into meditation. I have manifested many things after coming into meditation. For example, I had, uh, I had received many awards in my workplace because of of being very empathetic this is again something which is a ripple effect I would say coming into meditation once we are very clean from inside it is a ripple effect it just ripples out everyone can see the difference perhaps we might not see it ourselves 
but surely the outer world would definitely see the uh, the importance and and the um, effect of meditation that we practice so i would love to kindly ask request everyone to practice meditation and thank you so much for pssm and pnc for giving me this opportunity to spread uh, my my journey into meditation thank you and namaste